Good morning. Good morning, Sheppy. Today so is our second day at Disney, and you can't tell we're going to the swimming pool for the first time. Sheppy's never been swimming, but he is so excited. Are you so excited? Guys, Mickey Twinny Chunks on and his dinosaur hat. My nana got him these and my mama, or my nana got him that. She got all this stuff. And so we're gonna go swim it and we're at the little marketplace at Beach Mall getting breakfast really quick. And then we're gonna head down to the pool and spend a little while at the pool and then head over to Epcot. And Sheppy, tell us what you did last night for the first time. Oh my goodness, <laughs> I am just like my mom and daddy and I sleep the best at Disney. <laughs> So he slept for through the night for the very first time last night. And I dreamed of that day because I needed sleep for so long. But um, it didn't matter because I woke up like every 10 minutes. I was like, I should breathe in. I should breathe in. Why aren't you awake yet? Because he's never done that. He's four months old. And he's never slept through the night. Have you seen this candy land over here? And they have a Jungle Cruise game. Usually like collecting Disney board games is our thing, even though we haven't really ever played them except for the clues. But one day we'll have this nice little collection that we can have people over for game night. So Rick got not Mickey waffles, but mini waffles for the first time. Mini, cute. Is that the platter? Yeah, the platter, the deluxe. What'd you get? I got the sandwich. I got a sandwich too. Should have got my sunglasses for breakfast. at the pool. Shepard did a really good job for his first time being in a pool. And on top of it being his first time, it was freezing. That water was so cold. And of all the things in the whole world, my son does not like. Number one, it's to be hungry. Number two, it's to be tired. Number three, it's to be cold. <laughs> so we were rushing back to the room to get him rinsed off and get him down for a nap because he was super tired. That sun drained you about in half the time as it normally does for you to get tired. So we're heading back to the room. We're gonna get ready. We're gonna head to Epcot. And I guess I should text my mom and dad because they went to go get in the hot pool. The hot, <laughs> the hot pool? They went to go get in the hot tub and they don't know that we left the pool. Okay, I feel like myself again. <laughs> I have had a shower. My hair is clean. I have makeup very, very minimal makeup on. Most yeah. importantly. Yes, I have my ears back on. Oh my God. Jeffy's ready to go too. Jeffy's ready to go. He's got his fan, he's got his bus, his cute outfit, happy. Pop left his phone in the room, We're waiting on them to come back for us to leave. His magic bank keeps not opening the door, so my mom had to go walk and help him get in, get in the door. We're headed to Epcot and we're so excited because it is Flower and Garden Festival. Our favorite, our favorite festival. festival. Somebody's content right now. Lolly woke me up from my nap. I was ready to go to Epcot, so she turned around and said, whoops. We swapped everything into the stroller caddy. I got this on Amazon. I can link it below. Um, but it's got a pouch, like right here, that we have Shepard's blanket in, some shoes. Hey! Here they are. We have his hand sanitizer that I can just like pump, and it's like the Noodle and Boo hand sanitizer. It's my favorite. All his passies and toys. And then all of our portable chargers are in a zipper here. And then it's got the big pouch in the middle. Everything is like right there. Super, super nice. And guess what? I'm not carrying the backpack for the first time in like ever, probably. Y'all ready? Ready. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay. So said, yeah. Lots of trial and error. We've got Shepard in a carrier with Daddy. Hey, and oh no, shoo! Thank you, <laughs> thank you. And we had shoes on. We better take this other one off. Yep. No. Nope. At least we got a picture with them all. He does have his sunglasses on. 
Oh my goodness. Hey mama. Hey, you cool baby, huh? You cool, dude. Tipper, what can you egg cut? So here's the first booth in France. I, literally until a second ago. Like I knew that it was Flower and Garden and then I forgot. <laughs> And then I saw this and I was like, oh yeah, it's Flower Garden. And we just said, we can't wait to go to Flower Garden. This little baby has changed my brain. That macaroon. I amazing. want that. Let's get it. Jennifer, look at all those baby lovers. We love you. We stopped at the little thing for Flower Garden and we got the, it's like a chocolate macaron. Never had one of these, ever. And I'm really not supposed to be eating chocolate because of Shepherd, but I just want to try it and I'll get the rest of Jared. But how's all those little? They look like dipping dots. <laughs> They're so good. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm gonna love that. And it's like a brownie cookie. It's like a brownie, but on a stick. With brownie a on shell. a stick. With a crunchy shell. You like just one bite? Oh, wait, just one more. Okay, I'm done. Shepherd, everybody loves those glasses, baby. We gotta go find you something to put on your head. What'd y'all get? A frozen rose. And then you got just whatever the French beer is. It's like 1964. <coughs> no, 1664. It's really good. Salute. I thought you wanted me to drink. Salute. Salute to you. So we made Shepard a little good. turban out of out of his poo swaddle because he doesn't have a hat. We looked at the room. Hey. Okay, now we're between France and Morocco at this, what do you say, this lot? I love Fresca. So I'm gonna get the sugar cane shrimp and Jared's gonna get the lamb curry. I got the sugar cane shrimp. I'm gonna try to get a little bit of this sauce off. And Jared, no, yours looks really good, Jared. So I got the lamb curry, and it comes with rice, and those are plantains. There's mom. This is the, the dad cam. Yeah, this is dad cam. We're doing this up. See how how calm I am. Steady hands. Getting Brittany moving in. She's moving in on the shrimp. Let's see what she does next. How does she handle this? Oh. Lolly's getting her a sip. And Brittany's back at the front. What is this? The um, tropical freeze. That's a tropical freeze. Mm. Very pretty, very good. Jared's eating whatever he's eating. Lamb curry. How many? Lamb curry. All right. And what you eating? Booby. Nothing. Booby. <laughs> Amy, you want to play take, oh, take one. Okay, we're gonna kill it. Little bit on the top. Little, little. So, like all these are spices that they have planted here. This is right outside Morocco. This is their like showcase. Is their spice that they use? These little things are built out of what they season their stuff with. There's the star. Yeah, the anise. So two stops so far, or two for two with good yeah, stuff. I'm so we're fully expecting Morocco to have like a Kefka pocket and hummus fries. Hummus fries, they have, yeah. They have <laughs> Just that's what they have every time. Every single year at their food mine and at their flower So hopefully they've got something new because Jared, that's one of his favorite booths during festival season. And he just gets the same thing. So he's kind of like, oh, what can we have something different now? Well, they don't have either of those things this year, so they have changed it up. <laughs> None of it really. I'm definitely skipping this. Yeah, it doesn't sell near as good as what they usually have. So maybe changing Bacon. isn't a good thing. Okay, what y'all get? Frushi, shrimp, and crab. Um, something. Ooh, you taste the spice. That's good. Right at the end. And then a blood orange. Mimosa? No, it's what do they call it? It's a sangria. I have a picture of it on the menu. It's a blood orange and let me go look. It says a blood orange and sour. We want y'all to try that. We want y'all to have that. The shrimp and crab. No, I that is awesome. That is like one of the best things I've had. 
very, very, very good. What do you think about the first one? I haven't it's tried good. it. Oh. Very good. Very desserty. But that right there. So good. Yes. yes. I'll let Jared try it. But the Jared. first sheet is very good. Just spit it out. Say next time you don't want one. So what are you trying? The fruit sham scale. No. Yeah, I can do a white one. Eat it. No, you gotta eat it. Chew it up. It's, you can taste that fruit inside it. Yeah, taste it. Eat it. Keep going. Chew it. Chew it. Keep going. <laughs> Chew it up. Keep going. For the baby. For the baby. The baby says you gotta eat it, mama. Yeah, that was a texture thing for me. That was not happening. Shepherd, this is Mitsukoshi. Mommy and Daddy love this store. <laughs> but it used to be much better, so don't judge it too hard. All right. Oh, Shepherd, do you need one of these? He said, Pika, Pika, you like it. You want one? Pika. Hey. You like it? Yeah, want one? Hey, you want one? You want the brown one? So, Pick a Pearl is closed right now. It's totally empty. That's definitely a big change for here. Well, it's one half a pop now. <laughs> And a Disney trip for him until he has a beer and turkey leg. I'm here for to get the turkey it. and beer. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pumped they finally changed that place over there that used to be kind of a, like burgers and maybe chicken and stuff. And now it's, I think it's more like barbecue, which I think is definitely really truly American. So I'm glad they changed that restaurant. Well, we're in Germany and wanted to get Shepherd an ornament because they always have really pretty ones in there. And I just couldn't find one that I love. I wanted this, the blown glass Mickey, but I wanted the blue one. They used to have them in all different colors. Now they just have white ones or ones with bows on them. So I decided not to get one. Oh well, we'll find you the perfect one somewhere. Shepherd's eating a banana. Not actually a banana, but his banana toy thing. <laughs> Shep, you ready for a boat ride? I gotta just pull it down. Hey, oh, oh. I love it. No. <laughs> okay. I'm sure we'll see him any minute now. Oh, science is great. There's so much to know. Climb aboard explorers. It's time to go. Kind of old. 
That's jellyfish. You're good. And I'm thinking jellyfish. And the next one, jellyfish. Oh my goodness. Nemo finally put him to sleep. Shepard hasn't been asleep since, I think 1.45 is when he woke up. I have this app that I use called Huckleberry and it keeps up with like Shepard's naps and when he took a nap and it has been far too long since he took a nap, but he just fell asleep. So I'm gonna start the timer and whenever I stop it, it keeps track of his like appropriate wake time. And so when I stop it, it'll tell you when he needs to have his next nap. Love it, I literally don't know if I'd be <laughs> on top of his naps like I am if it wasn't for this app. But while he's asleep and daddy has him, we're just gonna hop on um, Spaceship Earth because it'll be an easy ride for him to just stay asleep on. And we didn't ever think we were gonna get to ride this again, like ever, the way it was. But it's kind of exciting that we're getting to see it again the way that we thought we never would before they do the refurbishment if they're even gonna do it now. So I'm excited that we're gonna get to see it again. Oh yeah, and Tiffany's here. Yep. I feel like I have to say that every time we're at Epcot. Oh yeah, and Tiffany's here. See, you literally just appear in all of our vlogs. Like, they're gonna be like, that girl follows them everywhere. I don't, I, do they know her? Like, she's in the background of all their videos. We know her, it's Tiffany. We actually met right there. Like right there in that, that open concrete area. Yeah, it's calling her. Hello. No, we're getting on Spaceship Earth. Bishop. Shepard finally fell asleep. Shepard's not going to get to see Spaceship Earth, but that's okay. We just left the land. Now we're gonna take Sheffy over to see Figment. I'm so excited. That's gonna be such a good ride for him because there's so much light and sound, sound and yeah. colors, and he is a baby, and so obviously <laughs> he loves that kind of stuff. Trevor definitely does love that stuff, so um, I'm excited for him to ride it. He's eating his blanket right now. He's going yum 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 yum. You can't even see anything. It's dark over here. I didn't realize how much there's no light right here. Like usually there's nowhere that's like not lit. Well, at Disney. And very dark it ain't lit, Sam. It ain't lit over there. <laughs> Alright, where is stroller parking for Figment? This is something we've got to learn about all these stroller parkings yeah. now. headed back to the room. We were done with Epcot. Shepard made it till park closed and pretty much as soon as it struck nine, he was like, it's nine, it's time to go to bed. I know it's nine, it's bedtime. Y'all better get me out of this park right now. I'm ready to go to bed. <laughs> he is a little bit fussy, but he did really good. His biggest problem is not taking naps 
because he's so very very aware and we were not responsible and we left the house or left our room without a sound machine for the park today or our baby shusher we have a baby shusher and they both work wonders and we were trying to be minimal because when we got off the airplane yesterday we, we had to take basically everything we didn't have time to unpack and stuff because our room wasn't ready we left our luggage but our backpacks and Jeffords diaper bag was fully packed so today to make up for yesterday we were like we don't want to bring anything well we need to at least meet in the middle because we definitely needed the sound machine and the baby shusher so tomorrow morning we're headed into animal kingdom and you best believe the shusher the shusher oh my gosh it's coming if i had two shushers two shushers would be coming it'd be a shush -sh -sh. hey remember how that thing she just talked about being alert <laughs> yeah are you ready to go bed this your house welcome home